I've worked for Cotton Care for about 15 years. I first started when I was 15. Fergus, the hotel catering manager, his daughter uh, came to me and asked me if I wanted a position in one of the kitchens that was available. First started washing up for Cotton Care and from there I was asked if I wanted to attend catering college a few years after. I think everyone thinks that everything's either stuck in the blender and pureed or it's really, you know, one choice on the menu, not, you know, the variety of, that we do have, the seasonal change that we have with our menus and stuff. I don't think people really understand. We always have at least three or four choices on the menu, it's never just one. We've always got um, a main choice. There's always your fish of the day, omelettes, salads, vegetarian options. So there is, there is a good variety of, of food on the menus. I would say they're five star nice items. If someone wants to describe Amberwood as the Ritz of Cotton Care, you walk, as soon as you walk through the front door, you can you really get the feel. It's, I think Amberwood has a more classy feel about it. Yeah, I like, you know, as soon as you walk in, the grandness of it. It's very hotel-like, it's very nice. I think it's really important to come out, speak to the residents and get that feedback from them on you know, what they think of the meal. You know, they look forward to lunchtime interacting and socialising with you know, other residents. It's you know, one of the highlights of the day, so I think it's important to come out and you know, ask them what they think of it, really. I do get excited to, to dish it up and then come and ask them if they've enjoyed their food. I love that feedback. It's good fun. Um, I enjoy working at Amberwood. The, the staff are fantastic, really helpful and um, I enjoy, enjoy my job. Audio Jungle.